Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. And guys, today is a little bit of a bittersweet day for me as a Dallas Cowboys fan. It was officially the retirement of the, in my opinion, the best Dallas Cowboys quarterback of all time. We're not going to debate that in this video, but Tony Romo did retire today, unfortunately. Uh, but fortunately for us in Madden 17, EA did actually produce a career tribute card for Tony Romo. This is a 99 overall card, guys. Definitely an absolute beast. We're going to take a look at the attributes right now. Uh, first of all, card art on it looking pretty damn fire, got to be honest with you. This is, again, a limited time card, just like the DeMarcus Ware one was a few weeks back. 80 speed, which is pretty solid for Romo, but the throwing attributes are nasty, guys. You have 96 throw accuracy short, 97 mid, and 93 deep, along with a 96 throw uh, power along with a 95 for play action throw on the runs a 90 I mean this card is very 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 nice guys very very good quarterback 1.12 million right now is the lowest price on it this is a couple hours well about an hour after it dropped live into the game that I'm recording this video so what I'm gonna be doing today guys is trying to pull this thing I'm gonna spend everything that I've got trying to pull this Tony Romo today guys so uh, we're gonna see what we can do we're just gonna go through um, standard pro packs and uh, let's see here if we've got anything else that we could open up here potentially season star is probably not the move to be honest like let's be real that's definitely not the move we're gonna go pro packs here um let's see yeah season stars what do you even get in a season stars you get one season star items four team items and 100 contracts like mm, three gold or betters but they're 60 000 coins that's definitely not worth it so uh let's just rip through these guys let's see if we can pull a tony romo that would be freaking amazing we're gonna try and do it this is just gonna be a pretty quick video guys um well not i guess a pretty quick but we're gonna rip through the packs pretty quickly here I'll try and get the best card the best tony romo card that i can remember them making i i feel like there was a golden ticket romo at one point um but i don't remember for sure might have been a few years back so uh yeah i don't i don't remember necessarily but yeah this romo is definitely very very good we almost opened up the season star pack there but uh yeah i mean we've got plenty of coins to rip through here today i guess you know what i'm probably not going to open up all of my coins just because that's going to be like a ridiculously long video uh, we do get a random kevin mawai there but what i want to do is just pull enough of them that i'm giving myself a good sample size so we'll probably do like i don't even know maybe at least half my coins in pro packs here today so hopefully we pull something good and uh so far we're definitely missing uh, pretty much across the board haven't even pulled an elite yet granted we're only like four packs in but still want to try and get something really nice today guys that romo would be a nice little pull for me for sure that would definitely help out the old mutt bank account here because i'm getting down there 350k right now now granted i can always get more coins but i really i really just don't uh, like I, I don't really build up my team in this game mode right now like i don't even have a good team right now it says 64 overall that's because i haven't replaced some of the players in my lineup and randomly we get a season star elite collectible here vance mcdonald okay we'll take it we get anthony bar gold okay that's at least better than like a standard gold card um but yeah like i i just don't really build up my team that much in mud i i really just want to play with this romo and have some fun with it i obviously can't afford it with the uh with the coins that i have and we get a champ bailey strength card that is a really nice pull 89 overall that is a really really nice one guys because that is one of the ones that you need uh, to complete the Champ Bailey set and obviously Champ Bailey is one of the new legends So that is actually a pretty nice pull. I will definitely take that Don't know what it's going for right now, but that is probably one of the better pulls that I have had recently in the game So uh, I, will, I will definitely take that. That is a great pull back-to-back -back elite uh, Collectibles oddly enough basically collectibles Champ Bailey's technically a player But it's essentially a collectible at 89 overall at this point in the game uh, But definitely a valuable collectible there. So that's certainly a good thing and we get it here nope rashad johnson all right so yeah i wonder from you guys what are you guys getting in your packs have you guys pulled the uh tony romo or what else have you guys pulled have you gotten anything really good recently i know obviously there were some golden tickets that were added or ultimate tickets that were added recently into the game um i know one person that's a subscriber pulled one of the ultimate tickets and he's going to keep us pretty well informed, I think, throughout this whole process. Uh, he's been giving me updates so far daily on what's been going on. So far, it hasn't been a whole lot, he said, um, regarding exactly, you know, like what the order of things is going to be, what 
what things they can upgrade, stuff like that. They haven't gotten their form yet. I think once we get the form, he will be providing that to me on the channel. So we'll be able to go in and take a look at exactly what you can and cannot upgrade this year in Mutt. Uh, for ultimate tickets now obviously this year we're talking ultimate tickets versus golden tickets so we haven't heard anything about silver tickets yet oh by the way i just need to do this real quickly while i'm thinking about it let me just throw that in there sorry randomly in the middle of the video but um i i don't know there might be something different this year uh regarding the golden tickets uh and the fact that there's not silver tickets that we've seen so far the fact that they're calling them ultimate tickets and not golden tickets to me indicates that things are going to be a little bit different so i'm hoping that you're still able to upgrade some of the stuff that we really really care about obviously like speed um and, and stuff like that things that really change the overall a lot for players that's what i'm really really hoping for uh, or not the overall like st things that change the actual like quality of the player I should say because the overall rating can get changed by all kinds of different wild stuff like awareness and stuff like that That really doesn't make that much of a difference if any difference at all when your user controlling the player especially um, And I know a lot of us when we're talking about golden tickets We're talking about players that we're gonna user control running backs uh, quarterbacks things like that uh, linebackers safeties potentially players that we're going to be typically user controlling a lot uh, we want those players to be the golden tickets a lot of the time now granted there's usually at least some wide receivers we usually get some cornerbacks things like that my personal opinion is i don't like having golden tickets of those things because uh if you've played this game enough you know that the uh at least the cornerbacks defensively like they just don't really do that much of a different job if they're a really good cornerback versus a mediocre cornerback um i mean like the the man coverage attributes the zone coverage attributes they like don't really seem to change all that much to be honest with you um yeah they will play a little bit different especially the man coverage zone coverage is is uh if you guys haven't seen it with gut fox's video zone coverage is not what you think it is <laughs> like uh, it's not how well the player plays in the zone. It's literally like the difference between if they can swat the ball away or not. Like, I know that sounds ridiculous, but that's what, we, what we've seen it actually be. And we get another collectible here. Um, Tyrell Williams, a, what is that, 1920 plus yard receptions. Oh, okay. So 19 total 20 plus yard receptions. Okay. I was like, what the hell is that? 1920. Like, obviously he didn't play in 1920. What is this? But, um. But anyways, yeah, so to me, I wouldn't do cornerback, but that's just my personal opinion on it. I, I like to use a uh, golden ticket on like a, a middle linebacker or something like that. We do get an elite here, Ryan Schrader. That's our first base elite pull that we have pulled in this entire pack opening video, and we're like over 100,000 points in at this point. Still hoping to pull this Romo, guys. We're doing it through pro packs, like I said. I think that gives you the best opportunity to pull them, so that's what we're going for here. And unfortunately, we miss across the board once again. Damn it. Let's keep it going, though. We're still going to... We're going to pull down to... Let's pull down to 200,000 coins. Uh, and then we'll reanalyze from there and see if we can get anything good. In the meantime, if we miss pretty much across the board, then we'll probably... Uh, We'll probably stop the video there. That'll still give us like five. We'll do six more packs here. And if we get anything decent, we'll probably continue it and keep on going. So come on, baby. Let's get this Romo going. Let's get this Tony Romo. Pull that elite. Damn it, man. That is so brutal. I keep pulling just garbage golds as well. Like, really not anything of any value, unfortunately. Uh, we did get that Champ Bailey, though. That Champ Bailey is certainly something of value. So we'll go take a look at that. Um, at the end of this video and see what it's going for But uh, unfortunately right now we're missing pretty pretty badly right now We're gonna do six total packs like I said from the one before so we still got what four more come on and Anything nope two golds at least but nope not really anything of value come on Three more packs more before we reanalyze let's, we'll go take a look at the champ bailey and see what that one's going for as well because i really don't know to be honest with you i know it's the lower overall of the the elites but still should have some value because it is a new player in the game so hopefully it's worth like i don't know at least 50k i'm hoping i don't know though i, I really have no idea what it's going for right now and we miss again final one before we go take a look at the champ bailey and then reanalyze Hopefully you guys had better luck with your packs. Like, this has been pretty rough right now, other than the Champ Bailey. Got a couple of the uh, Season Stars collectibles, but that's about it, unfortunately. And yeah, we miss again. So, all right, let's go take a look at this Champ Bailey. Because I know that the Champ 
is definitely uh, one of the better uh, Ultimate Legends that they've had so far in terms of price. So let's go see what we've got here. And actually, I still have a random pack as well. I'm going to go take a look at that. But uh, let's go see here. Elite and um, newest. Here we go. So champ. All right. Oh, never mind. Sorry. That's, uh, that's definitely not champ. Let's go to... There we go. Strength. Okay. And damn, this one's only going for 19k. I was hoping for it being at least 50k. So uh, that's a shitty collectible, unfortunately. I mean, it's just basically paid for like three packs. Or I guess like two and a half packs. So uh, yeah, anyways, guys. That is going to do it for the video. Make sure that you drop a like on the video. And, of course, also make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you are new. Thanks again, guys. Hope you have better luck pulling the Romo. And if you do and you want to allow me to borrow them, I would appreciate it. But uh, thanks again, guys. And I will talk to you guys again soon.